where have I been? That's the question, right? <coughs> See, that's what I get for trying to be cool. This, this ain't cool. So I've been doing a lot of stuff. <laughs> I piled it all up for you. Put it all in one bundle. This is the video of, of those things. Enjoy. I woke up early because I have to work on another commission painting that um, someone ordered on my website. So today's the last day for me to finish it. I'm waking up really early because uh, one, I have to send them um, their painting so that they approve it um, before I ship it out. And then two, the earlier that I get this done, I'll be able to go out today. I spent last night working on it all night and then today I'm finishing it off. And just with communicating with them, today's the last day that they're gonna get um, a photo for them to approve. And once I get that out of the way, then I can just have fun. So here is the actual photo. Here is the portrait. It's getting there. Look at the browns that I used. Oh my gosh, I'm just like, girl, you did that. Look at his skin, it looks really nice. Um, her, I just started, so she's not coming through just yet, but she will look like him pretty soon. <laughs>
portrait of Nipsey Hussle. It was to honor him as a person and his passing. Nipsey was an amazing person. He was a very handsome person. Uh, <laughs> and he provided a lot for his community. Um, you know, created a lot of more job opportunities for African Americans. So he was definitely someone that um, needed to be honored in my eyes. Portrait painting of Lena Waithe. She's, of course, an African American woman. Um, she's a creative person just like me, and also, you know, she just carries herself with pride. The things that she say, she owns it, and I admire that about her. And I try to apply some of the things that she do business-wise to to the things that I do as far as my business. It, I posted online. Um, she noticed it, and I was very honored and happy that she saw that. A lot of my supporters have noticed it too. You guys helped me um, with that too. So thank you so much. taking a trip to Washington DC I wanted to see um, the african-american museum it took me about two days to finish I didn't get too much um, footage in there 
um, because I was just so involved. There was a section about Haiti. It showed the history of how Haiti won their independence and the weapons that they used and the instruments that was used during the war. I believe I have a picture of that drum. I was just so excited. I, I took a, a picture of it. Hopefully I have it all posted. But yeah, I walked around. I went to go, went to go see the White House. Um, I went to go see the Martin Luther King um, statue and, and other things. DC was pretty fun. It was really, really fun. For inspiration, um, before I start a portrait painting, I go to the majority of my books that I have already, and um, I have a book of portraits. That book has different portraits of um, from different types of illustrators. It inspires me to make sure that when I'm painting, I'm painting with a lot of color and just personality. So that book definitely inspires me. And then I also have another book that I look at. I think it's called The Louvre of Louvre. I forgot. Um, correct me if I'm wrong. But this book has a lot of old classical paintings that um, shows an old fashion of how people used to paint and still are using those skills to this day. I like to switch it up. But going through this book confirms um, how I'm going about a painting when it comes to lighting, you know, depth, skin tone. Um, um, I'm not an, an illustrator. I don't do like, like cartoony, I don't say that in a bad way, but like illustrated type of things where you can just be creative and, and create your own character. I do like to make sure that when I go about a portrait painting of someone, I'm doing it right so I like to practice and on my observation skills but thank you so much for coming back to my channel thank you for watching um, if you would like to find other ways to support my business or my channel you can visit my website which is painterfrancois.com um, I now have my original pieces um, available for purchase and you could just check out my gallery to see what else I have online for you guys to see and, and purchase and share with others and let me know if you have any questions I, I would love to do a Q&A, but I don't have enough questions to do one. Um, so I'm just waiting for enough of those. Um, post your questions down below. You can um, ask a question on Instagram. Just hashtag paint her Francois and repost one of my photos with it. I'll be able to see a lot of your questions and then answer it on the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. If you did not like this video, like it anyways. Um, and I hope to see you guys again. Thank you so much. Bye.